In Women of Valor this year, God reminded me that he's not finished with me yet, and he does have a plan for my life. That I know God now, and I didn't even know that I could or that I didn't to actually know him, not just know about him. And um, I see God in my life now where I never even looked to see if he was there or to see a party played. And I see him everywhere now. I came to Women of Valor this year wanting to know more of God's wisdom. And I was surprised to learn that learning wisdom really had nothing to do with becoming anything, but more about getting closer to God and just listening to him. To be able to like talk and pray to him um, as much as I can, like throughout the day and be able to read my Bible and know what it means and not and translated that over, not just saved it for, like, worship or for, like, the hard situations. Um, I used to think that everything that I did, all my works, would add up to how much God loved me. So if I did 10 works, you know, he would love me 10 times more. And um, I learned that that wasn't true, that God died on the cross and he gave us a gift that he pre-mailed for us, and that was in his sacrifice and his salvation. So the entire time that I thought God wasn't talking to me before I joined Women of Valor, um, just before I didn't spend time with him, like I wasn't in the word, um, like I would talk to him and he would talk back, but I, it was, I couldn't hear him. I was shut off. Like you and I, like if we're in the grocery store and yell my name, I'm at first, I'm not going to know that it's coming from you because I don't know you. But the more time that I spend with you, the more I get to know you. If we go into the store a year from now after meeting you or a year from after minute time, just sitting and talking or getting to know each other and we go in the store and you yell, Danielle, um, I'm going to know it's your voice. I'm going to know that it's you. So, so just really spending time in the word and just hearing from him and, and learning the words. And when things would happen, I was like, how is this affecting me? And I couldn't see past that. I noticed that my daughter was being very, very selfish. I remember yeah. at one point saying to her, it isn't all about you. I hear God saying, and it's not all about you either. It's and like, it really is not about us. I've always kept people kind of at an arm's length. And um, that's hard to do in Women of Valor. So um, God just set up the right people in our small group is to um, allow people to love me, trust God with the women, trust God with the program. You learn so much about who God is, and that's important. You gotta know who you're trusting. Um, you, there's many times we're told to trust God, but if we don't know him, then how are we gonna trust him? So I'm, I'm called to be a warrior for them, and the women of Valor's taught me how to do that. It's amazing on the backside. And through my deep desire to know God and to have a relationship with him, it is so exciting. It is so unbelievable. It is so fantastic. It is so majestic that you do just want to tell somebody.